Hi, Gary Lehman in San Diego. You know, a long time ago, when I was first playing harmonica on stage, uh, the only harmonica I would carry with me was a F harmonica, and that was because I could easily get the draw bands. F, of course, is one of the higher keys har of harmonicas, and so now I don't routinely carry a high F. I usually have a low F in the um, bag when I'm going to go to play. But sometimes it's nice to have a high F when you want to play cross harp and you want to be able to get those bands and play in C, which was my my usual uh, thing. I would use an F harp and play cross harp in C. Uh, so to that end, what I've done is to carve up a C harmonica t for high G, because high G uh, is a specialty harp, and uh, I, I didn't have one. And so I really don't have one now because this is a little different. It ends on B. Uh, so holes 3 through 10 are like 1 through 8 on a regular G diatonic harmonica. And of course up an octave because G is a low key. High G would be the higher key. Uh, that again is a special order thing. This harmonica goes down to B. The low two notes I have tuned to B blow, D draw, E blow, F sharp draw. And of course on the bottom, uh, on, I'm sorry, on hole three, it's, uh, it's G and A. like a regular harmonica. So the bottom draw chord is a D with a D in the, in the bass. And there, of course, you have your typical pretty woman. Configuration like a regular harmonica. So here's a little bit of it with some guitar. I'm really a guitar player. Surprise. This will be blues in, in D. That's where the, the two notes, normally two and three, are the same, blow two, draw three. Uh, here, because it's two holes up, it's on uh, four and five. Now that's in cross harp. It's, this is a, a fine harmonica for playing melody and octave up as well. I made it so I could play cross harp high, um, you know, cross harp in D um, on a G instrument. The nicest thing about this is a true high G 
It's too high. Um, who goes above the seventh hole anyway? Oh, I know. All your real harmonica layers. Um, so by eliminating the top two holes on this thing, I've kept it still in a high range. I made it from a C. And a C is still a fairly high harmonica. So this way I get the advantage of having that full um, octave and a half of G uh, in a higher range. Does that mean I won't bring any other G harmonica? No. <laughs> um, who knows if this harmonica will actually see the stage anytime soon. Um, but it is a worthwhile addition to the kit. You can never have too many harmonicas in too, too many different tunings. Unless, of course, you're, you know, capable of playing one C harmonica and playing in every key on a C harmonica. Diatonic. Uh, ramblings. So this is Gary Lehman in San Diego once again. Do not do as I have done. Spend your time practicing the harmonica instead of tuning it to odd tunings. And I'll see you either here in San Diego or online. Thanks for listening and paying attention. Bye.